Okay. Well, some people want the wing to draw. Um, kind of make a wing like the one in this sketch I'm working on of Discord. Yes, I am a My Little Pony fan, but whatever. And this will probably show you in real time motion how I draw my wings. I'll probably end up using the same pose as the one in the Discord drawing. So, basically, I'll get. Oh, actually, I start with a bigger size brush. Oh, note, I am using the program Paint Tool Sci. Anyway, I'd make the basic shape. And make sure. And just make sure that you get the basic shape. And make sure you make it like you're drawing an arm, only slightly more wide. And it has feathers, not fingers. Yeah. Anyway. This is going to be the basic shape for the wing. And I'll just, you know, resize this. I mean, it'd probably come out a lot better if I were putting a lot more effort into it, but yeah. Anyway, first you're going to want to make where the long feathers would be. I haven't memorized the names for all the feathers. And then I just kind of do this. Like you would draw a bat wing, only, yeah. Now, the second step is I put a gill layer, well, I obviously lower the opacity, and get a smaller brush, and and I'll add the details to it, like the fact that there's feathers. See? Um, like, the arm usually has the short little feathers. that usually distinguish the fact that it is in fact an arm. And sometimes I end up drawing the angles a little bit different than usual, but that's perfectly fine, because then you can just drag it down. And there we go. I mean, the, the lo amount of large feathers you want can vary depending on your character. But this case I chose six. And then you just do this. I mean, I'm not one to add huge amount of detail to the wings, but this definitely shows you how I draw them. Please note that the feather tips can either be pointed, like this, or round, like that. Yeah. Whoa, oh, no, I did not want to do that. Oh, I'm gonna make this a full-sized canvas, and I guess I'll line it. Um, this brush is a little bit too big. Yes, there. I don't know if I'll be able to fit in the shading and all that, but I can at least get it lined and probably colored. I kind of like to draw what would be a miniature wing inside of the full-size thing. I mean, this probably isn't 100% anatomically correct, but considering I draw things that probably wouldn't actually exist, I don't think it matters.
All right. All right. I got. I think I got it completely aligned. So let's go over it again. Basic shape. See, this is this is just the very basic shape. This is it with a little bit more detail. And this is it lined. Now, I don't usually do this, but if you really want to distinguish the fact that it's feathers, you could just add a small line to show the fact that it is in fact feathers. It usually helps a little bit with shading, but I don't usually do it often because I actually don't draw wings very often, but when I do, people seem to be very interested on how I do it. Now then, uh, I usually add some final details, like erasing this, these extra lines. And occasionally I'll sharpen up the already done lines. See, that looks a lot nicer. And doesn't look like it's going to just. I don't know. I, just, I, I like to smooth out my points a little bit. Now, I mean, sometimes the fade is actually really useful because then when you shade it, it kind of fades into there and shows. Oh, hey, this is a specific color. It blends in perfectly. Yes. I, I like that very much. Now, I'm getting close to the 7 mark, so I'm just going to color this in really fast. Hopefully not too fast to where it's sloppy. I may make a shading tutorial after this if people really so desire, but my shading's that great, so yeah. And I, I hope my mic isn't too low. Plus I'm kind of socially awkward, so I tend to be quiet when I'm talking to myself, such as in this manner. Normally I'm actually talking to someone, but recently, nope! Oh well. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave a comment on the actual video. Uh, that was a little bit early to place. Oh well, I have two minutes to finish coloring this. Well, I'm not actually going to color, I'm just going to fill it in. I'll probably end up changing its color to like blue, and I'll see if I can fit in how how I choose colors. You know what? I actually think I'll save that for a different video. In fact, I may just make an entirely different tutorial. Oh yes, I'm a minute. I have a minute left. Oh, god. Um, I'm probably rambling now. Oh well, at least I'm almost done filling in with color. Bam. Just finish that, and there we have it. A, a wing! It's a wing! It, yes, it's a wing. Alright, um, bye everyone.